Hi, my name is Simon Patrick. Here today we have the McConnell RoboCut RC40 Generation 2 Remote Control Bank Mower. The RoboCut is powered by a Yanmar three cylinder 40 horsepower stage 5 diesel engine. The machine comes standard with two roll bar protections one on the front one on the rear of the machine and metal panels. The rear guard can be locked in position for accessibility to the air filter and the radiator. Lifting of the front bonnet gives you access to your fuel tank, your hydraulic level, your onboard battery, charger for the remote, a 12 volt supply sat there and also the get me home box which allows you to track forward and back and lift the deck up and down without using the remote unit. Track options on the Robocut are standard tracks, which will get you up to 40 degree slopes, super tracks, which we have here, which will get you up to 50 degree slopes, and spike tracks, which will get you up to 55 degree slopes. RC40 comes equipped with many attachments. Here today we have the 1.3 grass flail head, equipped with Y flails, with the option to upgrade to hammer flails. The machine comes with lateral float, adjustable side skids, adjustable rear roller, and a hydraulic front hood. Got two uh, head floats on the machine, 15 degrees on the head, and also carriage float. On the side of the machine, we have the control panel, which is giving us temperature gauge, fuel gauge, engine RPM, and warning symbols. All our C40s come equipped with a carry case, which you can store your remote control unit in. Remote control battery charger, 12 volt. Your hardwired get me home control unit. The bleed bottle for attaching onto the attachments when not in use. And finally, we have the grease gun that comes with the kit for the track tension. Now onto the operation of the remote control unit. On the right hand side we have the S key, which turns the remote on and off. The green button then pairs the remote with the RoboCut. The joystick on the left does forward and reverse and does the hydraulic front hood left to right. The joystick on the right does the steering right and left and also does the deck up and down. Toggle switch does the start and stop. Next one along does the rotor direction, uphill or downhill cutting. Next toggle switch is Track speed, number one, up to 4K, number two, up to 7K. We next have the reversible fan off, manual, or timed for every five minutes. Spare auxiliary there if you have an attachment with more than one auxiliary services. Engine RPM, plus or minus. The bias control for working on steep banks to keep the machine in a straight line. Have a speed control for forward and reverse. This last one then does your speed of your rotor. We also have a battery warning light for the remote control battery when getting low, and we have the e stop for any emergencies. Now, to start the Robocat, there's a key in the ignition to turn on, turn the S key on, the green button now. Pair the machine, which sounds the horn. The machine is now paired. Now start the machine on the toggle. Now to stop the machine. Thanks for watching. That was the McConnell RC40 Gen 2. For more information, visit McConnell.com.